News 7x7 is a unique channel dedicated to the news from dairy industry. Every week you receive brief on top 7 dairy news on this YouTube channel from India and abroad. These news could be seen in detail on our channel dairynews7x7.com also. You may write in the comment box on the dairy topics of your interest. We will try to develop news feature on the same. Your constant feedback and patronage to this channel is our source of top 7 dairy news from the week of December 4th will cover. How animal foods nourish the world in times of climate change. Andhra Pradesh registered 26% increase in milk production in 6 years. Maharashtra plans to gift over 12 lakh bovines to farmers in 5 years. Japan to use fuel from cow dung to power its rockets. Neobank Dick Vriddhi backs $6 million funding in Series A funding. Sensor measures cow nitrogen impact on pasture by urination. And Global Dairy Trade Price Index up by 1.6%. IDF and the European Dairy Association EDA organized an official side event at COP28 on how animal sources food nourish the world in times of climate change. NDDB from India also participated. The aims of this event were to provide a holistic, a balanced approach encompassing nutrition, economic and social sustainability and climate action within agri-food systems to highlight the importance of terrestrial animal source foods for healthy nutritious diets to support sustainable aligned with climate action objectives and to emphasize the inclusion of dairy and terrestrial animal source foods in school meal programs. At her turn, Ms. Samriti Singh, manager of the NDDB Foundation, spoke about the relevance that dairy in general and school milk programs in particular have in feeding a billion people and providing livelihoods to a large percentage of families in India. School milk programs ensure assured markets for milk in otherwise distant geographies and steady income to local farmers, she said. And she gave concrete figures. 7% decrease on stunted children, 24% increase in IQ results and 10% increase in school attendance. Andhra Pradesh recorded nearly 26% increase in milk production in the last 6 years, from 1.21 crore tons in 2016-17 to 1.5 crore tons in 22-23. The state which accounts for 6.7% of the country's total milk production stood in fifth place among all states in 22-23. Andhra Pradesh has a per capita availability of 799 grams of milk a day, almost two times higher than the national average of 449 grams. Milk production from exotic crossbred cattle increased by 3.75% and indigenous non-descript cattle by 2.63% as compared to previous years. Milk production from buffaloes also increased by 3.69%. Bullish on dairy industry, Maharashtra State Animal Husbandry Department has drawn up plans for a big cattle drive in Vidarbha and Marathwada regions. A proposal to make available 12.5 lakh cattle for farmers of the two regions in five years may soon be put up before the state cabinet. It means that in one year, more than 2 lakh cattle will be distributed to farmers. We need to increase the number of high-yielding cattle in less time. Apart from AI, embryo transplant will be employed, which is like surrogate motherhood in humans. The embryo generated out of the egg and sperm of a high-yielding variety will be transplanted to the womb of another cow. The state will also encourage entrepreneurs to start cattle farm under the center's breed multiplication program. Under this program, 50% subsidy up to Rs 2 crores is available for setting up a farm with 200 cows. In 2017, a Kolkata-based company launched extremely cheap and environment-friendly biogas-fueled buses on the Indian streets. Five years later, such biogas-run buses were being deployed in Indore as well. Now, a Japanese space startup has taken this a step further by adopting a similar technology to power rockets. Japan's space industry opened a new chapter on Thursday with the successful test of a prototype rocket engine powered by fuel derived entirely from cow dung. The liquid biomethane used in the test was made entirely from gas derived from cow manure collected from two local dairy farms. The general consensus about this moo negative is that it could benefit both space travel and agriculture. Interstellar Technology CEO Takahiro Ingawa explained that cow dung is not only environment friendly but also cost effective and delivers high performance. Dairy focused net banking startup Digivriddhi Technologies DGV, 
has raised INR 50 crores as a part of its Series A funding round led by Omidyar Network India with participation from existing investors including Omnivore and InfoEdge Ventures, among others. Digivriddhi will deploy the fresh proceeds to expand its footprint across Karnataka, Andhra Pradesh, Telangana, Madhya Pradesh and Maharashtra. The Bengaluru-based firm offers dairy farmers and micro-enterprises access to institutional credit while easing and digitizing payments across the dairy value chain. In 2021, the startup backed seed funding of $3.1 million led by Omnivore and InfoEdge Ventures. Ag-research scientists have developed a smartwatch-like sensor which listens to a cow urinate, measuring the amount of nitrogen hitting the pasture. Livestock farming comes with several environmental challenges, but one of the main ones is the contamination of waterways from nitrogen which comes from the urine of dairy cows. Scientists at Ag-research wanted to measure the nitrogen impact on pasture and to see if it differs from cow to cow. They developed acoustic urine sensor which are strapped to the back leg of a dairy cow. They record the sound every time the cow urinates. Ag research senior scientist Brandon Walton said typical dairy cows urinated 10 to 12 times a day. But research has shown that there are some cows that urinate more frequently but in smaller volumes. So their nitrogen load is spread out more. Global dairy trade event on 5th December concluded with the GDT price index up by 1.6%. Key results remain as AMF index unchanged at an average price of US dollar 5573 per metric ton. Butter index up by 0.7% at an average price of US dollar 4936 per metric ton. Skim milk powder index up by 1.2% at an average price of US dollar 2671 per metric ton. And whole milk powder index up by 2.1% at an average price of US dollar 3104 per metric ton. Thanks for watching Daily News 7x7 channel with news update from last 7 days. To continue receiving update from this channel, I Kuldeep Sharma request you to subscribe this channel and share and like the video and also don't forget to press the bell icon. Thank you.